Wanda, and this is my adventure. Today I'm thought I'd go through my DVDs, figure out what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to, you know, keep in the car or, or in the van. Um, I noticed a lot of people spend a lot of time watching DVDs, and I am one of them. <laughs> Probably one a day, I guess, you know, but uh, I'll watch the same movie over and over sometimes. Like, um, what do I got? Charlie Wilson's War. I've watched that a million times. I love that movie. Tom Hanks, it's good. I don't know why I like it so much, but I like it. Um, a lot went on in the 80s when I was, I, I graduated high school at 84, but um, a lot went on that I had no clue about, but, you know, I was a teenager. I didn't care. Um, Larry Crown, another Tom Hanks. I like that one. I've seen that one several times. Um, these I've had for a long time. Got a lot of Elvis. Uh, Blue Hawaii, Fun in Acapulco, Girls, 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 you know, good one. Um, got a few Bob Hope movies, The Great Lover, I love old movies. Got some uh, Darren Rogers, a four pack. Robin Hood, Kevin Costner, oh, he's such a hunk. Um, some more Elvis, Spin Out, Double Trouble, Kid Galahad, some more Bob Hope. Uh, Cary Grant, there's four Cary Grant movies, and Jerry Lewis, The Nate Professor, I don't think I've watched that in a long, long time. So, I've got Pink Floyd, The Wall, I love that. That's like my house cleaning movie when I was in the apartment. I would put this on, turn it up really loud, and just clean house. The Point, if you haven't seen that, you need to, it's animated, Ringo Star narrates, it is Awesome. Um, good for kids, good for adults. I've watched it since I was a kid. I'm not sure what year it came out, but, um, and it doesn't say. 74 minutes, though, of animated awesomeness with Ringo Starr. Oh, it's good. Good, 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 good. I've probably had three or four copies of that over the years because I was just wear them out. You know, I had the VHS and, <laughs> and now the DVD. Um, the Fifth Element, Bruce Willis, another good one. When I feel like an extra movie, that's the one I usually throw in. Um, the Labyrinth, this is, it took me forever to find this copy from Blockbuster, so of course it's got a Blockbuster box on it. Um, David Bowie, Jennifer's something, I can't remember her last name. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I've watched this since I was a kid. I believe it came out in the 70s. Uh, my kids watched it. This and The Point. If you have kids, show them to your kids because they are awesome, awesome. You will, they will want to watch them over and over. You will want to watch them over and over. Um, Kevin Costner and The Postman. Really long movie, but it's great. This has got to be one of my all-time favorite movies. Tom Petty is at the end, so you have to watch for that. And, of course, the best of Bonanza, because I love them old westerns. Let's see, I've got The Blind Side, the excited to put in, Bridget Jones, the first one, How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days, and I watch that every once in a while. And uh, this one has City of Angels with Nick Cage, which is, okay, it's pretty good, I've seen it a few times, and uh, Michael with uh, John Travolta, which is another good one. This one is a guy thing. I can't remember that girl's name, but anyway, it's that's a good movie. Don't watch it very often, but every once in a while. Talladega Nights. Gotta love that shit. Fifty First Dates. I've probably seen that a million times. But um, what I usually do is I'll flip on a movie in, in the evening and set my timer on the TV. Where I wrote, just set the timer for an hour. Turn on the movie, and usually I'm asleep before that hour's up. And last night, I watched Blue Hawaii, and tonight I'll probably do that again, too. Um, I've seen the movie so many times that falling asleep is no big deal. I'll just watch it again tomorrow. Right? Right. So, anyway, that's the movie. I'll probably get rid of a few of them and um, try to get some new ones 
and these are all these are all junk. Somebody gave me just a pile of movies, but they're all they're not junk. But Grand Torino with Clint Eastwood, that's pretty good. And Castaway, that was that was okay. That was Tom Hanks too. Repo Man, I don't know what that is. Michael Clayton, I think I saw that. I think that was pretty good. But um, The Divide, I don't know what that is. American Pie Band Camp. <laughs> Uh, Ghost Protocol. I don't know what that is. Assault on Precinct, Valentine's Day, and Bounty Hunters. Hey, those are going to go in Fall 13. So anyway, if there's a movie you think I should watch, please, you know, comment below and let me know. I'll see if I can find it and watch it. Um, like I said, I love old movies. I love funny movies. I love old westerns. Um, yeah, that's it. Anyway, so that was the, the interesting DVD collection for now. So, hope you enjoyed. Y'all subscribe if you can, because you know, because you can. Um, check me out on Facebook, B. Lafada. Um, I'm always on there. So, even got it on my phone, I think. So, you know, whenever there's a signal anyway, it's on my phone. So, anyway, I'm sitting in the house where I'm house sitting. This is where I've been sleeping since I've been here. I'll be here till the 14th again, so that's eight more days. Yay! Eight. And that's it. So, ciao, babies.